COVID spreads quickly. School districts and health leaders are doing everything they can to keep the classroom a safe space so students can continue to learn in person. A big piece that's ensuring students and staff have masks. WCNC Charlotte's Chloe Leshner is live at Atrium Health in Dilworth. Chloe, Atrium is working to get more people protected. Yeah, hey Fred, Atrium Health is donating 1 million masks to different community groups and the first was Charlotte Mecklenburg schools. Doctors say masking is a critical form of protection with how contagious Omicron is, especially in the classroom. School districts are navigating a third school year in the pandemic. Ready? Right now, vaccination rates are stalled and testing supplies are strained. Doctors pushing the need for several layers of protection. But at this point, masking is still an important tool that we can use to prevent spread. PPE is what CMS leaders credit for a so far successful and safe school year. Our face coverings policy has enabled us to keep many more of our students in our buildings learning in person with their peers. Superintendent Ernest Winston says they have millions of masks available for distribution to both students and teachers. Atrium Health helping to keep teachers and staff safe by donating 150,000 KN95 masks last week. A recent guidance suggests that N95 or KN95 masks may provide additional protection. And our local county health department leadership suggests that if possible, that if available, these masks may have a benefit. Several other districts are reinstating mask mandates in light of the Omicron surge, but the entire community needs to stay protected to ensure kids can stay in school. Atrium also pledging to donate 1 million masks to groups in need or underserved areas. Dropping off 50,000 at Medicist, a nonprofit pharmacy helping the uninsured. We're realizing with the rise in um, COVID cases, particularly through the Omicron variant, that we really need to do something to get masks out into the community again. CMS officials say they are thankful for the support and welcome anything, any other support that can help keep their teachers and students in the classroom. Any organization that needs a KN95 mask donation from Atrium can reach out. We have that information on our website, WCNC.com. Live at Atrium Health, Chloe Leshner, WCNC Charlotte.